Hi, and welcome back to another weekend vlog. If you're new here, thank you so much for tuning in. Wait, what? Welcome back to another weekend vlog. If you're new here, my name is Misha Cherie. And if you're not, thank you so much for tuning back in. Yo, I forgot my intro for like two seconds. I want you to take a great look at me. I look homeless. But it's because I'm on my period. I started literally today. I feel like shit. So you're not gonna see very much of me today. But, 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 before I let y'all go, I just need y'all to know. <gasps> Yo, these, these crazy puffs? I mean, yo, they're delish. These are kind of crusty, so you can't really get the whole picture, but, oh, so good. Okay, so, I do have a lot of updates for y'all, but I'm not gonna lie, I need to lay down and get my heating pad. I'm not feeling it today. You know how day one be. You know how day one be. I'm on day one. Even though I went to the gym this morning at 5 a.m., I was like, I don't care. I need pizza. And I've been waiting to try these puffs too. You know, Little Caesars originated in Detroit, Michigan. So actually I don't know if it was Detroit, but I do know it was Michigan. So I was like, oh, I need to, I walked to my local Little Caesars here in New York and was like, run them crazy puffs. I was a little nervous because I thought that they only came, I thought there was a chance that maybe they only came in pepperoni, but you can get them in cheese, just so we're clear. But yeah, girl, I have been working while under a heating pad. I'm about to go crawl back under it and if i can we'll check back in today but i will probably see y'all tomorrow just being fully transparent watch any other vlogs then um you've seen bits and pieces of this room before it's kind of like a content space where sometimes i do sit down and get ready with me um it's also obviously my closet my desk is also over here so it's just like a hodgepodge of a room that i usually never show y'all because it's usually cluttered um because i need to purge but anyways that's neither here nor there good morning it's saturday um, as you can see, I look crazy. Thanks for picking my clothes out with me. I ended up deciding on just like these little black Lululemon pants that you probably can't see. And then um, just this little jacket because I had picked out like a sage green colored one at first because I have two sets of these. But then my Pilates socks, I was like, oh, these match. So we're just going to roll with these. Oh, let me put some more deodorant on. First off, I'm in dire need of more workout clothes. Um, I just am. I just am. I just am. I always just never cared about what I looked like when I went to the gym. And it's like, why would I invest in more clothes? Because I don't even be there like that. But since waking up at 5 a.m., I'm going, like, way more frequently than I used to. Um, and I'm also just learning that, like, when you're... Different workouts require, like, a different wardrobe if that makes sense and you can show up differently for different workouts as well so like right now I'm I never I never do anything to my face before I go to the gym but for this workout because I'm gonna see a friend and like you know Pilates is like way more like low impact I'm like let me do something this is like an okay looking situation I don't love it but 
I really got to step my workout game up. I do. I have to. But this is kind of what it looks like. Just like this little jacket. It com has compression in it. And then um, my leggings. Ugh. <sighs> Sorry. I'm on my period. And I'm just trying to like keep it moving. But I'm struggling. Anyways, I have I have to do something to my hair. Um, and I don't want to like make it look amazing. Because as soon as I get back from Pilates, I got to come home and shower. Because we have plans for the day. So, yeah, I don't want it to look, like, amazing, but I need to do something to it, because this is crazy. Um, so, yeah, let me just throw a little something in it. Anyways, yesterday, girl, I literally didn't do a thing. I didn't do nothing. I sat, well, I'm lying. I sat on my couch, um, well, during my lunch break from work, I did go and get, like, a little Caesars situation. Ugh. If y'all haven't tried those crazy puffs yet, you need to. Um, you know Little Caesars is from back home, so if they're dropping something lit, I'm on it, period. Um, I'm doing this. I just figured I would just go ahead and add a little heat. I was, trying to, I was gonna try to avoid heat, but I'm like, I'll just add it and then I don't have to do it later. Um, so I'm not, this is my heat for the day. I'm going to go meet up with my friend We've gone to this Pilates place before. It's actually the only time I went was with her. Um, but she goes, she could, she kept going. She goes all the time. Me, I was like, mm, thanks, girl, for the invite. And then I never went again. So, but I do want to start having Saturdays be my day that I do like a fun activity. Like I get active, but I don't necessarily need to consider it a workout per se, if that makes sense. So, like to me, I think Pilates is like the answer to that. Like, am I sweating? Am I dying? No, but I did move my body today and I think movement is really the goal for me versus like okay like sweat your life away do the hardest workouts you can so okay so as you can see I kind of like just did something to my head um I also wanted to show like this I got this during a brain campaign with rainbow and like I really do be wearing it to work out it has like the little thumb holes and everything which I think is so cute um okay so this is new for me but we're trying different things. Um, I'm gonna do a little something to my face. Granted, already understanding that like when I come home, I'm gonna have to shower and just, please don't do that. Um, I'm gonna have to shower and redo whatever I just did. But I think the things that I'm gonna add are so minimal that it's like, honestly, it's almost like, what is even the point? And I'm also leaving my little pimple patch on there because while I'm working, it can be working, okay? Um, but I'm just gonna go ahead and put this in there, my little refi brow gel and i have this gunky gross brow pencil or brow brush and i refuse to like do anything with it because i feel like because it's gross and stiff and full of product that's kind of like what helps me be able to use it to style so i just start by like back combing and adding an additional product in there because you know if you don't have enough product that junk will not stay and if I'm about to be like, you know, I might have a little bead on the brow area, like a little bead of sweat. So I need it to stick. I'll just smooth that bad boy up. Yeah, that makes me feel better. Even though I'm just going to a workout class, like it's nice to just have something there, you know? So. Um, yeah. See, so, yeah, I just kind of like back home this situation to add. Uh, a build up a product and then now I'm gonna take this little nasty brush and literally just like boop brush them up and I go with like the natural curvature of the brow so like obviously your brows go up in the front but as you start to kind of go out towards the face they do the same now I just take this grossness please do not judge but I'm not cleaning it sorry 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 judge your mom um if anything I would just get another one but boom and we're set Instantly, I feel better. Instantly, I feel rejuvenated. I feel like I need some hydration. I'm gonna just use my Tatcha Luminous Dewy Spray. I need some more of this, clearly. Um, but she's expensive. Mmm, that feels so good. Some of this stuff, honestly, like, yes, it's hydrating, but it's mood boosting. And I think that's, like, the biggest thing. It's just, like, feel good before you go to your class. Ugh, feels so good. <sighs> okay. 
Loki, what time is it? What if I'm late? Ooh. Um, and then I'm just going to use this Colorstay Extension Air just for a little bit of mascara. Um, and then we're going to call it a day. I'm about to get up out of here, y'all. I need to pack my little, um, I need to pack my little, uh, belt bag, my little Lulu belt bag. Because I'm just going to walk with that in my camera and call it a day. Um, I wish I had like a little cuter gym tote, like a bigger one, because it's also a lot just like carrying my camera during this walk. Should I come full of gym bag since I got to carry the camera or just leave it alone? So I'm just going to go ahead and throw this on. For the longest, I couldn't find it and I thought I had lost it. And I'm like, I'm not buying another one. Y'all, I've lost two Laneige lip balms. Um, I haven't lost any Summer Friday. I think it's because they're a little bit bigger. I've lost, what else? Countless chapsticks. I just be tired of losing stuff. Mm. If, you, if you watch the channel, you know, like, I started to vlog putting some gloss on. I hate a dry lip. It literally makes me so uncomfortable. I don't know if this is giving gym girly, right? We're ready for the Pilates. Yes, this is cute. Okay. So I'm gonna pack my little gym bag because I have the memory of a goldfish. I'll forget everything. I'll forget these. So I'll forget everything if I don't pack now. So I'm just gonna pack all my stuff and then we're gonna head out. So I'll see you on the walk. I might just call and catch a play. I might just come see you today. You wait, I'm stuck up in my way. Okay, so I my battery died and I didn't get a chance to catch you guys up, but obviously I'm not in Pilates clothes anymore. Um, I left, had a great time working out with my friend, and now I'm gonna head to brunch. So I will see you guys there. Bye. Okay, so we're back at the train station. We meet here again. Um, we're gonna go into the city to go have brunch at this spot called Little Ruby's. The stairs for the train, they be taking your girl out. That's why I gotta be back in the gym on the stairmaster, but. Um, I kind of want to show y'all what I have on, so just hold on one little second because I think it's kind of cute. I kind of love it. Um, I have a top knot again. Basically, while I'm going through this hair stuff, I'm just going to keep wearing a top knot. But let me show you what I have on. Okay, look. So, this is kind of big. I've been seeing girlies do this. So I want to try it out. This is the shoe. So, I've been wearing... I've been wearing these pointed toe shoes, but then also adding socks just to give it more of like a streetwear-esque vibe. So yeah, I will catch you guys when we get to brunch. Sunday. I know I'm sorry that I keep doing this y'all it'll be like a, a break in the day the thing is though literally on the subway as we're heading my stomach starts folding in on itself I have never actually like felt the lining of my uterus feel like what felt like it was being scraped with a knife but that's legit how I felt I was like genuinely folded over on the subway which is a new experience for me normally if i'm like in the car cramping or something i'm like oh like you know i can like put my hand in my pants or something and like be like oh i don't feel well like i'm on the subway and it's a public space so i'm just trying to keep it together so we got to the restaurant i, sh I think i showed y'all a little bit of food also it was saint patty's and the was out 
heavy, heavy. I felt like I was an undergrad again. I was like, oh, y'all do not mess around about this. So it was actually kind of overwhelming. I'm not going to lie. We were in the West Village and I was just like, oh, like it's swarming. I heard somebody on the phone. They were like, yeah, and then we're flying back to Vancouver. I'm like, oh, people come from other cities, countries to come here for St. Pat. Like I had, I did not know. I was not prepared. So I'm sorry. And then literally I went to a dive bar and then I went back to my cousin's house and that was kind of it. So today's Sunday. Um, I don't have any Nespresso pots. Every vlog for the past three weeks, I've been like, I need to go to Nespresso store. I, need to go. I have not gone, y'all. I haven't gone. I need to do more research on this recycling program because I have like 30 pods that I need to recycle. <gasps> okay. So, but we are going to go get coffee. So let's go do that. I just want to show y'all how sick I am. It's actually crazy how much I be needing lip stuff. Speaking of lip stuff, there's some new items that I've been wanting. This is always like cute, and then when I wake up in the morning, it's it's doing that. So I mean, sorry. Okay, I was gonna say, speaking of needing things, Ulta emailed me and was like, "You have fifty three dollars in points." Me? Say less. I'm about to come spend it right now. So I'm really trying to like figure out if I'm gonna go to Ulta. The closest Ulta to me, well, it's actually not the closest. There is an Ulta that's closer to me, but it's like really difficult to access by public transit. But if you have a car, it's like a really quick, easy drive. So it's easier to like just take an Uber. But the closest one to me is um, in Midtown. And sometimes like you don't be trying to come tourists. You know what I'm saying? Um, I have on literally the same jacket and I just threw the sweatshirt on from yesterday that I absolutely did not get a photo in. So when you hear me talking about like, oh, I need to be back on Instagram, I need, I'm a joke. I'm a joke. I did not take any photos. Well, I do have to give myself some grace because I was folding over because <laughs> of my period. It hated me. Um, but also, I wanted to show you all these sunglasses that I got that I realized yesterday I got the wrong one and I'm going to take them back. But hold on. Okay, this is one pair. Mm, they're fine. I thought that I was getting the ones that are a little bit more structured, like a little bit more square, you know? These are just like, these give douchey aviator. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not really the vibe that I'm personally going for. So I think I'm gonna take them back and get a different pair. I should have known because they were so inexpensive. That'd be the thing about Amazon is you'd be like, oh, I found a steal till you figure out like, dang, I bought the wrong one. So, yeah, we're going to take these back, but let's go get coffee. The last thing I'm going to say is, before we go get coffee, is these are my eyeglasses. But, like, sometimes if I just feel like I look too bummy, like, I look too casual, like, I'll put them on. They do have a prescription in them, but I'll put them on. And every single time we're about to leave out the house and I put them on, Greg gives me the judgiest look. Because he's like, I know you're only putting them on because <laughs> you think they look cute, not because you're trying to see. Accurate, but still. Okay, cause like, you see the difference? No, uh, no, sorry, no. Okay, let's go get coffee. Hey guys, so it's a little bit of time later. We are actually out. It's St. Patty's Day. So we're meeting up with our friends Brittany and Berto. Um, we're like, we had two, we had to take two buses to get there. So we're like on the second leg waiting on the second bus. But it should be a lot calmer than it was yesterday. So I'm hoping, crossing my fingers that I'll be able to vlog. Um, I actually have on, I wanna show you my cute little ring, but I have on this like Supreme sweater. It's actually Greg's and um, with just like some green parachute pants and then like my little Joe Fresh Good 9060. 
sorry about that. Anyways, I'll check in when we get to our destination. vlog out and sorry I ended up losing my phone maybe like five six spots later so I had to like retrace my steps girl caught about two ubers had to sign in to find my it was a whole ordeal so then I said it's probably time to call it a night um so I didn't close out the vlog I did get my phone back so maybe it was my lucky day I don't know uh but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week stay weird Just come outside.